you going to move around a little bit? Are you strictly a running back, JK, or would you play running back and age? Or what can you tell us about that? Most talk, most of the talk is me playing mostly running back. Uh, whatever they want me to do, I'll do it. There seems to be an opportunity there, if not to start, but to at least to get playing time as a true freshman, especially enrolling early. What are your expectations, your uh, true freshman here? Uh, just get in there and play early. You do some great things early. How's the if workouts it, been? Workouts have been pretty good. Um, they're, they're pretty hard, but I mean, I, I can get through it. There are rumors that you guys didn't realize warm ups were warm ups. <laughs> yeah, the warm ups, when, when I first got here, it was the hardest thing. You know? I felt like it was the most difficult thing. So. Harder than practice? I don't know. I haven't been through practice yet, so I'll just see. I mean, harder than your high school practice. You oh, said it was yeah. the hardest thing. Yeah, it, well, not practice, but warm up wasn't the hardest thing in high school. Okay. You mentioned the reason that you, you wanted to be here as opposed to staying home. There's so many of you. It's a group of, of Texas players, and it could potentially grow today. Um, is there a certain bond that you all have already developed? Obviously, you all kind of already knew each other a little bit, um, but is there a certain bond, like you're coming here as a team almost, to take this on? Uh, yeah, we got a special bond. You know, all the guys from Texas are pretty close, and we just want to come here. We, we knew that this would be the best place for us, and we weren't scared to make the jump from Texas to Ohio, so I think it will benefit us in the end. What was the main attraction or anything else, JK, that got you here? Um, tradition, and I just felt that I'm part of this. But How you're much from LaGrange, you Texas, which is halfway between Houston, Austin, <laughs> San Antonio, and nowhere. No, I'm just uh, <laughs> How did that hook come? And had you known about Ohio State for a while, or just? Oh yeah. No, when I was when I was younger, uh, I always watched Ohio State. It's, it's a great school, great tradition, winning tradition. And I felt like, man, it would, it would be crazy to play here. So whenever I got the opportunity, I just could pass it off. And how are you physically right now? 100 percent? Oh yeah, I feel like I'm 100 percent. How much Lagrange, did the history? Dallas Cowboys town. Are you a Cowboys fan? Yes, this is a lot of Cowboys fans. So you've been was Ze Zeke influence? Was that part of it too? Were you following him the whole time not after he left Ohio State? Um, I mean, I always looked up Zeke. Zeke is a great player, you know. And I mean, he kind of had an influence on me. But I mean, it was, I felt like it was about me. JK, how much did that play into your decision? You know, the, the history of great running backs and NFL running backs, you know, Carlos Hyde and Zeke just in recent years. How much did that play into your decision? It played a big role because, I mean, you want to go to school, that's, that's going to develop you as a running back, as a player, and as a man. So whenever I seen, I seen that, I was like, ah, that's, the, that's a great opportunity. If it was just completely up to you, would you definitely rather be just a straight running back or are there parts of the H-back role that might be, like, interesting to you? I don't know. I mean, I like catching the ball too and all that stuff. So I don't. I don't really know. I couldn't tell you which one. I either or. It doesn't matter. Is it harder for out-of-state schools to come in and get a guy out of Lagrange? Because your coach said that it's so much easier for the Texas schools to come in there and you know, make a lot of stuff for the high schools along the way. But out-of-state schools often stick to like you know the you know, DFW area or Houston and places like that. Mm -hmm. Just. What was your experience like that, and what did Ohio State have to do to get you? Uh, I mean, I, I built a great relationship with Coach Alfred, the running back coach here. So that was that played a big part in it, and you know, just Coach Meyer too. Like, he always checked up on me every week, and so I feel like that played a big role. You know, and there was a lot of schools and other other places that tried to do the same thing, but I just felt like they were genuine, you know, and that's all I wanted: is genuine people. They put in the time though, as far as you know, talking to you all the time or you know, busy. Like, how often were they down there? Coach Alfred was down there a lot. Like I can't, I can't even tell you how many times he told me. Uh, they checked up on me. Coach Alfred, I talked to him every day. Coach Meyer, probably twice a week. You know, so it was just great relationships. What we talked to